Welcome to PointWise's Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature or demonstrate a technique in just a few minutes. In this video, we'll discuss how to grab a script from the PointWise Glyph Script Exchange, which is hosted on GitHub, and then I'll show you how to execute it. If you've used PointWise for any amount of time, then you probably already know about Glyph Scripting. That's how you can automate a lot of your activities in PointWise. These script files, whose names end with .glf, can be run from the script menu. Just click on execute and select your script file. Now where might you get some of these pre-made script files? I'm glad you asked. Open up your web browser, type in the address pointwise.github.io, press enter. This is the introduction page. Click on the hyperlink about halfway down that says Pointwise's GitHub profile page. This page contains a list of many of the scripts that we have available. There's actually several pages. I should mention that these scripts are unsupported, so if you want to extend the capabilities of any script, feel free to try your hand at it. Now each of the scripts shown here has a hyperlink, and if you click on any of these, it'll tell you information about that script. So it can be very useful. Today, we're going to use a script that calculates the area of a domain or the volume of a block. Now, we could search through the list, or we could use this little nice uh, search box up here. We'll just type in area. And there it is. I'll click on it. It's called DOM area block volume. And here are uh, you know some notes about how to use it. But to download it, let's click on the uh, green button that says code, and click on download zip. That's going to download it. And of course, once it's finished downloading, you uncompress it and put the files in your favorite location. And then we'll switch back to Pointwise. In order to run the script, we just click on the script menu, choose Execute. And I've already navigated to the location of my script file. And I click on the name of the script file, click Open. All right, and I have it for domain, so I'm going to push select. It says select the domains for area calculation. I just, I'm just i just curious about this one. I push done, and down here in the messages box, it gives us the information, total area. Uh, in this case, it's about 1,312 square units if you round up. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button to subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please drop us a line down below or connect with us on LinkedIn, which is linked in the description. Thank you all, and have a pleasant Tuesday.